manager Saha, that was interesting uh, in information. Um, I'd like to make a motion to amend uh, the recommended action. My motion would be a uh, motion to move forward with the recruitment effort led by the human resources director or motion to proceed with the recruitment led by a third party executive search firm and to strike out number the last or that's not something that we discussed. Um, so I would ask that we adhere to our original discussion. I have no idea what that means and who would we negotiate contract terms with. We don't have a candidate. So um, that concerns me that that was put in there as an option. Discussion for transparency should be either we choose one or two as the direction to say council. I think it could be construed as um, not being transparent to have something there that we didn't publicly discuss. The agreement we had at the last council meeting was to have the recommendation be one or the either. This is warranted. I, I feel like we have a very fine candidate working on staff currently who I have great confidence in. I've been working with Chris Swanson for three years and I speak now. I respectfully disagree. And I think it's, I think that, that we should not go with the, recruitment process. Well, I'd like to speak now. I respectfully disagree, and I think it's very premature for us to even Point be of having order. a discussion okay. regarding comments. Candidates. Comments are to be directed to the mayor. <laughs> Madam Mayor, I'm concerned that we're having a discussion about any candidates when we haven't even had a discussion on the selection process. I am not opposed to not opposed to any internal candidate being considered. I think it needs to be an open, uh, transparent process for selection, whether that is using our own HR department um, or an outside firm. Uh, so, I do have so I do have concerns that we would be having a public discussion about um, whom we preferred um, on the council. 100% agree it is premature to uh, go with the third option or consider the third option. A motion. I'd like to make a motion to appoint Chris Swanson, city manager, effective March 1st, 2023, subject to final council approval contract terms. If this council has a meeting of the minds of at least four or five members of council, that we agree that Chris Swanson is the best suited internal candidate for this position, it would be a farce to go through any kind of recruitment effort. You know, as a no idea, I've never even read Ms. Swanson's resume. That was never shared with me. I have no idea what her background is. For executive session under RCB 4230-110 section G to discuss the qualifications of employment, I think we should recess to executive session for 20 minutes. Okay. Council, we've met and we have a motion to, um, I, I would like the clerk to please read the motion. It was made by council member Wallen, seconded by council member Ween to appoint Chris Swanson effective March 1st, 20. It was not me. That's struggle. I didn't, Sorry. I had a hard time. I didn't know who either when I looked down that way. I'm sorry. I have problems with the voices still. I'm getting to know them. Strobel to appoint Chris Swanson effective March 1st, 2023, subject to final council approval of contract terms. Council, um, this is an employment decision and we will not be taking public comment at this time.
before we call the vote, um, I will be voting no because I believe this should be a public hiring process with community involvement. This is the second highest paid uh, staff position in government in the entire county and the most important job in the city government and I believe the most important job in all of our county government entities. So. Um, you're, you're doing the roll call vote. Council member Boudreaux. No. Council member Kendall. Aye. Council member Ortiz. Aye. Council member Strobel. Aye. Council member Ween. Aye. Council member Wallen. Mayor Wallace. Aye. Motion passes. Congratulations, Ms. Swanson.